welcome to today's news the news headline police speak on bomb explosion at may 29 presidential andover venue thank you for tuning into this channel and please don't forget to listen to the end the news details contrary to information that emerged late tuesday night over alleged bomb explosion at the eagle square venue of the may 29 presidential inauguration the federal capital territory police command has debunked the story police public relations officer fpro sp josephine ade in a statement in abuja said coastal bus headed towards the nyanya haxis caught fire within the vicinity of the eagle square at 9 pm today tuesday may 23rd 2023 at about 9 pm the coastal bus heading towards the nyanya haxis from muse was noticed with burning flames underneath, suspected to be due to a mechanical fault. The driver's attention was eventually gotten close to Eagle Square by Shehu Shagari Way, where the flames increased. The occupants safely alighted before the fire raced down the bus. No life or personal effects other than the raised vehicle was damaged as the situation was aptly managed by police operatives from the central police station thereby curbing any form of escalation Adair stated according to her members of the public are therefore enjoined to disregard contrary and misleading narratives emanating from malicious and misguided quarters even as the command continues to intensify the security of the territory in this transitional period and beyond there's an information that was released late thursday night that bomb explosion um took place at the Higo Square, where the May 29 presidential inauguration is supposed to take place. But the police command of the Federal Capital Territory has debunked the story that such did not happen. Then the PRO of the, the police, um, police command, Abuja, she said in a statement that the coastal bus that was heading towards Iyaya as is caught fire within the vicinity of the Higo Square. And it was no bomb explosion like the rumor said that it was bomb explosion. I don't know why Nigerians are of bad thoughts, like because um, a presidential um, candidate is to be announced May 29. Does that mean, does that mean um, bomb should be planted at the Eagle Square? Bomb does not have to be planted. I don't know why they have to just think about that. That's just very extreme, too extreme because now they are seeing bomb explosion as a normal thing for them to think that bomb can be planted at the eagle square because of the swearing in that is to take place may 29th we have bad thoughts we have bad thoughts we have we think about bad things because bomb explosion is it's it's very very extreme and we should not even think about that so the pro josephine has said that it was just a bus that caught fire and it was not anything bomb explosion the bus caught fire around nine and it was going through in yaya axis but it caught fire within that eagle square location so it's not even at eagle square and it's not even bomb location at all in our world she said that on tuesday a coastal bus was going towards yaya but it's past um eagle square so from we'll say they noticed that a burning flame was underneath the car so it was due to mechanical fault and it was not even bomb it was due to mechanical fault but before the driver could notice 
it had gone beyond what anybody can put off and it was when it was getting close to eagle square that he noticed that the car had caught fire underneath and it was just a mechanical force it was not even bomb because bomb cannot just take place like that and it's just going to be a small news it's, it's, i'm sure it's going to be a very escalated one but it was a car that just caught fire a coaster bus that just caught fire and no life according to josephine she said no life or personal effects happened except for the car that caught fire and the vehicle was damaged as the situation was aptly managed by police so it curbed any escalation they were able to curb any escalation before the thing became a very big issue members of the public are very easy to carry rumor we are wide minds like and we we think badly we are supposed to be thinking positively about the swearing in that is going to take place may 29th but that's actually a very bad thought thinking there's going to be a bomb explosion at the eagle square due to the may 29th swearing in what's your view about this news please share your view in the comment section and don't forget to like comment and share and also click on the subscribe button and the bell for more updates thank you